subscribe the channel prostech and press the bell icon to get latest technology videos once we release more importantly the subscription to the channel is completely free friends nowadays smartphones are the need of everyone and if you want to upgrade your smartphone to some other phone then this video would help you decide what to buy and what not therefore to get this useful information watch this video completely till the end because i am going to share all info with you so you are at right place welcome friends you are watching prostech so let's get started friends so starting with the honor 10 device it runs android 8.1 oreo and powered by high silicon kernel 970 processor with 2.4 and 1.8 gigahertz octa core with gpu mali g72 mp12 whereas oppo r15 runs android 8.1 oreo and powered by mediatek helio p60 with 2.0 gigahertz octa core and with gpu mali g72 mp3 Moving on to display then Honor 10 is 5.84 inches device with IPS LCD display having resolution 2280 by 1080 pixels and with 432 ppi pixels density. It comes with front back glass and aluminum frame and EMUI 8.1 user interface as well. Whereas Oppo R15 is 6.28 inches device with AMOLED capacitive display having resolution 2280 by 1080 pixels and with 401 ppi pixels density. Friends, this phone comes with a screen protection of Corning Gorilla Glass and with aluminum body. Talking about the internal memory, then Honor 10 is available in two variants. One is 64 GB and 128 GB with 4 GB RAM, and other is 64 GB with 6 GB RAM. But there is no micro SD support. Friends, as far as concerned about colors for this device, then it is produced in Mirage Purple, Mirage Blue, Magic Night Black, and Grey Gull colors. Moving on to Oppo R15, it comes with 128 GB of internal storage with 6 GB RAM and also support micro SD up to 256 GB that uses SIM2 slot. Friends, as far as concerned about the colors for this device, then Oppo has produced this device in hot red, snow white, and tar purple colors. If we talk about the dimension of Honor 10, it measures 149.6 by 71.2 by 7.7 mm of height, width, thickness, and 153 grams of weight with dual nano SIM option. Whereas talking about the dimension of Oppo R15, then it is 155.1 by 75.2 by 7.4 mm of thickness and 175 grams of weight with hybrid dual nano SIM dual standby support. About the camera then Honor 10 comes with dual 16 megapixels with 1.8 aperture plus 24 megapixels primary cameras with face detection auto focus and dual LED flash you will also have geo tagging touch focus HDR and panorama modes as well you can also be having different shooting modes with 1080p and 2160p at 30 frames per seconds and also equipped with 24 megapixels front camera for taking selfie with 2.0 aperture and 1080p recording moving on to primary camera of Oppo R15 it comes with dual 16 megapixels with 1.7 aperture plus 5 megapixels with 2.2 aperture cameras with face detection auto focus and led flash you can also find geo tagging touch focus face detection panorama and hdr it shoot out videos of 2160p at 30 frames per second oppo r15 also equipped with 20 megapixels selfie shooter front camera with 2.0 aperture and 1080p recording Friends in Honor 10 fingerprint scanner is placed on the front panel of the phone it also comes with different sensors like accelerometer proximity and gyro sensors with compass this phone also comes with wifi dual band wifi direct hotspot bluetooth gps nfc infrared port fast battery charging with 5 volts and 4.5 amperes dash charger type c reversible connector and usb on the go This phone is also powered by 3400 mAh non-removable battery as well. Whereas in Oppo R15 fingerprint scanner is placed on the rear side of the phone, it also comes with different sensors like compass, gyro accelerometer and proximity sensors. This phone comes with Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi dual band, direct hotspot, Bluetooth, GPS fast battery charging and with micro USB 2.0 and USB on the go. This phone is also powered by 3450 mAh non-removable battery as well. 
So that was the quick comparison of both smartphones. You can also check further details in the description below. What do you think about these smartphones? Do let us know in the comments section below. I hope you liked this video and don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.